What up, though, creative homies? My name is Ndubisi Okoye, and I'm a multidisciplinary creator from Detroit, Michigan. Today, we're gonna talk about Lois. It was my first mural back in 2014 that I did for our Detroit Vodka Distillery. So back then, I had no idea about doing murals. I didn't even have a desire to do a mural, if I'm honest. What got me into doing murals back in 2014 was my friend, Brandy Keeler. She is like one of my home creative homies. She's uh, a big sis to me. And she got me into doing murals. She was throwing a contest for our vodka distillery in Detroit, Michigan. Um, and she just hoped that I entered. I told her I, I told her I would enter, but I kind of knew internally that I was never going to do it in the first place. Uh, so maybe an hour before the contest was over, she reached out to me again. She was like, "I see you didn't enter this contest. I really think that it would be a good opportunity for you to do something new and to have fun in a different way. I think you would do well." When she called me on it, I was just like, "Okay, I guess I'll enter something that I already did before, so I don't have to do any work." So I entered in this sketch called Lois um, for my Imago Day art project. The community from Southwest Detroit came and like literally voted on which mural they wanted to see, and then the top picks would be selected, and you have to garner the most social media likes and comments and shares in 24 hours, and whoever got the most will win. At the time I was also working at Commonwealth McCann, a, a local agency in Detroit, and they were all for me entering this contest as well. They were, my, my immediate supervisor was like, I should enter. The entire the entire company was rooting for me to enter. So I entered. Um, and after I entered, I had 24 hours to get the most likes and comments and all that good stuff. And everybody at the agency that I worked at voted. Everybody that went to my church at the time, everybody in my family, friends from high school, everybody was voting for me. So I got the most likes in 24 hours. It was maybe a couple thousand likes and like four, four or 500 shares. Um, so I ended up winning the contest. Now the crazy part is I had never painted a mural before this. Um, so I, after I won, I literally was on Google and WikiHow trying to figure out how to paint a mural. It was my senior year at CCS at the time. So I was like hitting up my friends and a friend of mine, Ryan Wright, actually helped me paint the mural. Um, I was just like picking all the ears, trying to figure out how to actually execute this thing. So I got some local supplies from Blick and Home Depot and just went at it. Had a projector and just figured it out. And that mural came out amazingly. It's still up to this day, even though our Detroit Vodka is not there anymore. Uh, that mural's kind of been a staple of the community. People love it and still take pictures with it today. It was just great back then to to take a chance and do something different that I had never done before and just trust a friend. And it became a whole part of my creative career uh, to this day. So I hope that this inspires you to do something dope today. Peace.